Hey guys, here's your gaming news for today, Monday, June 30th. You can find the source links in the description below to learn more about each topic. A new Assassin's Creed game was spotted on Uplay. The game entitled Assassin's Creed Memories is tagged as coming soon for iOS, and the synopsis reveals the game will blend card battles, RPG, and strategy gameplay. Alongside the new film, a new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game is coming to the Nintendo 3DS on August 8th. The hack and slash handheld game will feature all four turtles and will allow you to swap between them at any time during gameplay. Gears of War designer Cliff Blachinski is coming out of retirement after he left Epic Games in late 2012 after 20 years with the company and says he will reveal his next project in one week's time. Valve's digital games platform Steam continues to grow. The service has reached a new milestone yesterday of over 8 million people logged into the service at the same time. That's a record for concurrent usage, up from 7.6 million six months ago. The surge in popularity recently is likely associated with Steam's ongoing summer sale, which sees hefty markdowns on popular games. Destiny could become the best-selling game of 2014. Analyst Doug Krutz from Cohen & Company projects Destiny will sell 10 to 15 million copies or an estimated 600 to 900 million dollars. Krutz's projection is based on Cohen's Ordometer, which estimates how many copies a game will sell based on the number of pre-orders and data from Amazon and the MPD Group's reports on physical game sales. Destiny has the highest Ordometer score in the last four years. After discovering over 7,000 Steam keys for Sniper Elite 3 were stolen from PC distributors and resold to unaware buyers, Steam and developer Rebellion have revoked the keys. The unsuspecting customers who bought any of the keys have been told to seek a refund from their sellers and may have to purchase Sniper Elite 3 again. Those affected will receive the Target Hitler DLC as compensation for the inconvenience. And that's our news for today. Join us again tomorrow for games industry coverage as it unfolds. Good night, everyone.